guys can see like that seat now nobody is sitting there so there's like social distance here you can see people are active again a lot of people in the train already yeah this lrt train basically things are coming back to normal actually in malaysia if you ask me they were doing there actually before you drive into the parking lot they hey my friend come and explore with bolo i love you yeah so how are you guys i hope you're doing good and fine so uh today i'm going to tour the trains for you guys if you are new to this channel this is happy family make sure you subscribe and hit notification bell so that you can always be notified anytime i upload a new video so you guys can see like that seat now nobody is sitting there so there's like social distance here you can see people are active again a lot of people in the train already yeah this lrt train basically things are coming back to normal actually in malaysia if you ask me so i just arrived chaos central and um, yeah you can see not so many people but things are still coming back to normal that's the train i just used the lrt train yeah there are people as you can see there are people and business is already coming back so hopefully i think the economy is reviving gradually from one of the news i just read uh it's like the malaysia is preparing for the economy to come back to full recovery and uh, next year okay early next year hopefully that will be possible hello guys how are you welcome once again to the channel thank you so much for clicking thank you for stopping by so today i'm trying to check the train stations and the trains to see what is actually going on okay how are they practicing social distancing and uh, are people coming out already so join me let's explore so as usual huh? oh. so yes i take my pass and i can go <sighs> basically this place is always filled up on a normal day but like you can see today nobody's at the counter and people are just so scanty i've used the lrt already and uh, i'll be going to the monorail now okay and there are different uh, protocols that are going on you can see they are actually checking people's temperatures in major uh you know movement areas and stuff like that as you can see right there and yeah basically people are practicing social distancing and make sure you cover your uh, your face with your mask and also get your hand sanitizers and I think we will be fine at the end of the day. <laughs> this pandemic has changed a lot of things. KS Central is always very busy on a normal day, but today is like absolutely scanty, you know. But people are already getting confidence and businesses are already opening. As you can see, gradually, gradually, gradually. So while going to the train station, I just decided to just sit down like, oh my god, on a normal day, this ground is very busy, like a lot of people, but you can see how it's so neat, so empty. This is really, really serious. <laughs> this is really, really serious. But I believe in a few weeks, things will get better again as people are already gaining confidence to come out. Yeah, and uh, shops are open, your favorite stores are open. You can come and get your wonderful... Uh, Things you may need. So I'm going to the monorail now. Okay, I'm going to the monorail. We have what we call monorail in Malaysia. It's like the one rail train. So I'll just go down like this. I want to see what those uh, they're actually practicing. Uh, if they're actually practicing social distancing and all those kind of things uh, in the uh, transport systems. Okay. So yes, uh, I just noticed that if you are coming in, they have to check your temperature and then you can what? You can go out, you can see what they are doing, they are checking people's temperature. 
then you can just uh, just for your own uh, protection and security basically uh, so this is the monorail station yeah monorail so I'll go and wait for the train now to arrive hand sanitizers are everywhere and just make sure you are clean you can see now they're checking the temperature even at the station there so I want to pass they will check my temperature now Okay, what's the number? Oh, thank you so much. So yeah, just check me and I'm still okay. So the station is empty basically at this time. And uh, as you can see, no train has arrived yet. I'm actually going to INB. I'm stopping at this station. Yes, because I'm going to the IT mall. What do you call the IT mall again? The big one, the big IT mall, the yacht. The yacht, yes. So currently now it's 27 pm here. You can see the information. Maintain social distancing of one meter. That's very good. The information kills ignorance. So basically, we are well informed. Uh, as regarding what we are supposed to do, people are maintaining social distancing, so which is uh, quite uh, very wonderful. I think Malaysia is trying basically from all I'm seeing. Yeah, so let's see how the train will look like and how uh, how the social distancing will be practiced inside the train itself. That's what I'm waiting for now. This is really serious. You can see all the information everywhere about social distancing. Social distancing, social distancing, the medical precautions and all that, okay? Can you see? Are you concerned? Please uh, provide assistance to those in need. Aren't you concerned? <laughs> if you are not concerned, then other people need it. So just do the best thing. Look at it. Let's practice social distancing. Please stand one meter behind the last person. This is really, really good. I wish all countries can take necessary precautions like this. You see that? things will move fast look at this seat also at the train station can you see there are marks just to show you uh to practice social distancing you understand so nobody can sit here basically normally this place can take up to four people but now only two people one person will sit here nobody here and, and that person here this is beautiful if you ask me the train is arriving now i don't know if you guys can see yes that's the monorail train just arrived to come and take us. Wow, it's almost empty, man. <laughs> That's serious. So this is the monorail I'll be following now, actually. So guys, as you can see, the train is moving now and it's almost totally empty. Although, maybe because of the timing. Yeah, but as you can see, there's social distancing practice even in the seats and there are a few people inside, but you can see everybody is sitting securely. So there's no cause for alarm actually. Everything is being organized in Malaysia at this point. That's our driver down there. I don't know if you can see him. And yeah, it's just so nice and refreshing that you can actually travel through the train without any uh, fear or uh, without any fear of any kind of uh, challenge happening to you. So the situation is under control here and I believe they will fight this thing as fast as possible.
uh, time possible as well as allow people to actually move around and to us do their normal duties. Let me know in the comment section below. If you have not subscribed, please consider subscribing. Enjoy this happy family because we are happy here, okay? And I'm gonna, like I promised you guys, I'm gonna show you around. Like you've not seen anything yet. Just stay tuned to this channel. There are lots more to show you in Malaysia. Malaysia is a great place. Malaysia is a beautiful country. When things are normal, I believe you really want to come and visit this country if you have not visited at all. It was a wonderful journey if you ask me yes it was a wonderful journey yeah and all the everywhere basically is almost the same protocol that is being adhered to everywhere every station you go the same thing so yeah that's it just make sure you wear your mask and then you are with your hand sanitizer and everything will be fine for you so i just this is loyat yes i can get to loyat from here so the same process just ensure you are then you can go uh, i'm going to loyat and uh yeah so hand sanitizer is there if you don't have your own you can how are you thank you you can uh, use their own basically and that's the city can you see how beautiful yeah life has come back life has come back i'm so happy for malaysia if you ask me because wow they are able to fight this thing in the best way possible in the best way possible just look, people are already coming back, you know. It's like things are already happening again. I would love to come and visit this Bejama, Bejaya Times Square. Yes, I would really love to come and visit it. It's a beautiful place. And I've been wishing to come there, but I was not able to come there before the pandemic and all that. So, it's just a matter of time. I will come there since things are getting normal again. So, what do you think? Tell me what you think about how Malaysia was able to fight this thing. And uh, still fighting it anyways, but we believe that things are better. See, buses are moving, cars, everything is just so perfect, so perfect, so perfect. Okay. Yes, I hope you're enjoying the video so far. If you are new to this channel, thank you so much for clicking. Thank you for stopping by. Ensure you what you subscribe, okay? Because this is a happy family, and we do a lot of things. We explore basically sometimes through discussions with with valid facts and most times through what going around okay basically due to the mco and all that we we're not able to actually go around very well but now things are getting better a little bit and i'm ready to use my camera to show you around malaysia the beautiful country with beautiful colors so make sure you are subscribed though hit the notification bell so that you are the first person to be notified anytime i upload a new video don't mind this face because that's the way we just have to be now you know the world has made us to actually be like this always wearing the mask how are you so some wonderful people like just always wearing the mask everywhere so yes make sure you do the right thing okay <laughs> and you will be fine at the end of the day notice what they were doing they actually before you drive into the parking lot they check your temperature this is really good if you ask me there are places where you can actually uh enter from okay this is loyat i've showed you guys loyat before but i believe i'll show you loyat again uh in a more presentable way it was a long time i actually viewed this place 
so i'll be going inside now you guys are going to see uh loyat and all that so just be very careful when you're coming here make sure you're with your papers make sure you are valid and then you can move around the way i'm moving around <sighs> so guys just imagine this is uh loyat loyat plaza you can see how so many people are here already yeah but at least they are practicing social distancing and everybody is with their mask who would have ever imagined that people would just you know have to be with their mask at a time like this you understand everybody must wear their mask and i'm also wearing my own with my hand sanitizer so it's really a wonderful time that i think the world will never forget this experience okay so you guys should comment below what do you think what do you think what do you think you guys should just take a look at outside look at the crowd look at the crowd look at the crowd this is serious it's like there's nothing like mco in malaysia at the moment i just met this lady here and i want to ask her one or two questions i hope she doesn't mind she looks black like me how are you lady <laughs> hi can we get to know you please what do you want to know what, what can you say about the current situation now in Malaysia, like you coming out and seeing a lot of people, you know, what can you say? Do you think Malaysia has been able to fight this current pandemic? Well, I think they are trying. I think there are still practices and operations in place okay. to track people and to keep people safe. So I think that's fine for that's now. That's fine. Everybody needs to be responsible for their own safety at this point. That's absolute. So when you entered into the the mall or what you came for here what were the precautions that we were taking yeah, or you SOP have to take a temperature and okay. also you have to um, write down your name and phone number oh write down your name and, and phone number some hand sanitizers hand sanitizers oh that's very great thank you so much and we hope that uh, you have a pleasant stay in Malaysia now and after the pandemic thank you so much so guys did you enjoy the video i hope you did so make sure you want subscribe to this channel okay and give the video a thumbs up a massive thumbs up and make sure you share the video everywhere and let me know in the comment section below what you think about the transport system and everything basically that i've showed you guys today in this vlog till i see you next time i remain my humble self bolu stay positive i love you guys so much more than my heart can take bye bye